Here's a trusty bucket update. Um, eight 285 watt solar panels on the roof, feeding a 48 volt system. And here we have the um, solar center, as I like to call it. I'm not finished with all of the um, shellacking, but so we've got two um, 48 volt battery banks, two batteries on a shelf there. So there's eight batteries in that closet, and then eight, eight additional batteries in this closet. This closes to seal these batteries off. Um, here is the, I haven't set it since I, I just finished installing this panel, so I haven't set the clock yet, but here's the um, Magnum remote, and then I have, just for sanity checks, because my battery monitor kit is bad, so I bought a couple of di digital volt monitors, and there are one or two things, small things, very small things that I have connected to 12 volt, two of the batteries to make 12 volts inside of, yeah, two of the batteries to make 12 volts. And so I have two voltometers here. One is fifth, um, for the 48 volt system and one is for the 12 volt stuff. That's just like my car stereo, actually, the stereo that I installed. You can see it up there. Yeah. So, um, then we have the DC, of course, the DC um, fuse box. And this is the battery shunt that comes with the with the remote. My remote is bad. They're sending me a new one. Um, so there's that. And we have the Magnum um, for 4400 watt pure sign inverter. And then we have the Magnum PT100 charge controller. Um, the panels come in. They go through a breaker. Um, and then combine combine at the breaker, go through, come in, um, and then I have two strings of four. I, I was running eight strings of two, I think, in previous um, uh, videos, but I, with the help of some really awesome people um, that have patience for my stubbornness, um, they let me know that the PT100 wasn't getting enough juice in from the panels, just two of them, that I needed to have, that I needed to have four um, at a time, and so that's what we've got running now. So we've got two strings of 170 volts coming in, um, two strings of four, and then that goes down and charges the batteries. The two battery strings are connected there through their fuses, um, and that's that. I just finished putting all of the covers on the on this um, crappy built shelf. I'm not a carpenter, but it gets the job done. And so I wanted to show it off. I think it looks, even as junky as it is, I think it, I think it looks pretty good. Not too bad. That's the solar power center, folks. Have a nice day.